Howdy folks. Well, as you can see, as some of you have mentioned, I have hit the slippery slope. Uh, once I got into the 3.75 inch figures, adding that to my um, Masters of the Universe collection, well that just uh, opened a whole new can of worms. Um, started with the Marvel uh, Retro 3.75 inch line, and then I decided I had to have a couple of uh, uh, Star Wars figures. And boy did that open a can of worms. So I think that's what's in these boxes. Um, I've got a whole pile of boxes building up on me because I just keep ordering figures with the, uh, the fear that I'm, they're going to go up in price before I get them now. Uh, it's very strange that um, figures are only available for such short times or, or you know six months to a year at the most windows. Uh, and after that they're gone and you're going to have to pay more. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into uh, package number one. See what I received here. Well, I'll pull one out at a time. Oh, there's a label on there. Oh well, it's all right. All right, Luke Skywalker Hoth. Very cool. Uh, good figure. Um, one of the early ones I ordered. Love him for the lightsaber. Like his outfit. Uh, I think the um, vintage one. It was a little crumbled there. Eh, well, I'm gonna eventually open these up, I believe, and have them on a shelf at some point, hopefully. Um, anyway. I'll see if I can peel this, uh, yeah, let's see if I can get this off without doing any damage here. Very slow. I'll do that uh, off camera. That's not worth wasting your time. Okay, what else did I get in here? Just one more. Nice. The uh, Imperial Guard. Very cool looking guy. I always like the red color of him. Cool helmet. Kind of mysterious characters. I had to have one of those in my collection. All right, so that's all that's in this bag, it looks like. I'll go ahead and get it out of the way and get into the next one. Yeah, yeah, they really got me on the hook now that I'm uh, this fear of lost stuff. It's pretty uh, snaky of these guys. I think they know it too. When they produce these limited edition things, you know, and then they don't give you time to think about whether you want to order it or not. That's how they really get you. They don't want you to think about it. Ooh, what's this? A smaller box. Do not separate. This is a set. Do not separate. What the heck? I don't remember ordering any sets. Do not separate the set. It is just Chewbacca. Wow. But it comes in a very nice box. Thank you very much. This condition is excellent, Amazon. That came from Amazon. No, was that Amazon? My goodness, somebody. Special seller there. These, uh, wow. Had to have Chewbacca in the collection. Not much more to say about it than he's just one of the primary characters. Oh, I can't do his sound. Never really could do the Wookiee sound, but uh, man, he's a great sculpt. He's got his mouth open. He looks furry. His fur really looks good. His coloring really looks good. Uh, that's a great figure. Yeah. And he's got his great crossbow weapon. That's just, that's awesome. His uh, laser crossbow. Not sure I love the the, uh, the fur coming off the hands there. That's a little goofy, but uh, oh well. That's all right. Can't have everything the way you want it exactly. So I'll take it the way they give it to me. That's pretty cool. So all right, we got one more there. Chewbacca. And this also says a set, but I suspect it's the same deal here taken care of well. All right, Han Solo Stormtrooper. <laughs> that's so cool that they're making the Stormtrooper versions of Han Solo and Luke. Now that's really kind of what got me into this wanting to collect these guys was I always liked Stormtroopers um, and Vader and I just really thought well, it's cool to get a version of a stormtrooper where I could have both Luke Skywalker or Han Solo and a stormtrooper, so uh, that's just really cool to have. That way, because um, stormtroopers just seem like they're hard to find. The stormtroopers, especially the, just the regular plain white stormtrooper, uh, I can't find them at normal retail prices. They're all sold out. So uh, if I wanted to get a stormtrooper, an army of stormtroopers, they might have to be an army of Han Solo stormtroopers with their helmets on. <laughs> we'll see. Um, I'm hoping they put out some more army building sets of stormtroopers because I would like to buy a, a four pack or a couple of those four packs. I think uh, it'd be really nice to add 
um, yeah, some army builders to these figures. So anyway, that's it for today. We've added these two prime characters, Han and Chewie, and these two will go together because uh, we know that Han captures or pretends to capture Chewie to get into the Death Star in the first movie. And uh, we've got our Imperial Guard, Emperor's Guard, and we've got our Luke. So we have our Luke, Han, and Chewie. Just not quite the right uh, versions of them. But anyway, really glad to have these figures. Thank you all for joining me on another unpacking. Hope you're having a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.